guys, what's up? It's your boy Worst Effing Gamer, and the brand new hero just dropped today, guys. So you know what that means. We are going right into this hero spotlight of the brand new Codring Stone hero. What is his name? Mazir. This looks pretty freaking awesome. Mazir view. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and try my first pull. And if I get him, I will literally shit the bricks. Come on! That would be freaking insane. But hell freaking no, it's not happening. Alright, I guess let's go with my temple, please, for the love of God. For the love of Dickie. Oh, 14 pieces. Alright, second temple, guys. It's always bad when you're on your second temple. That's not good. Ooh, I got him. All right, the Cosmic Guardian. <laughs> wow. Uh, that is holy moly, scrappioli. Pretty sick looking, man. That looks great. The Cosmic Guardian. Wow, yo. Check out this avatar. Uh, wow, this is amazing. This guy looks pretty sick. Mazir. I can't wait to check out this guy's abilities, guys. I'm really excited for this guy, for sure. Alright, so that's done. Let's go ahead and check out his abilities. How about that? Alright, here we are. So, I guess first things first. Let's get him to level 100 here. Alright, that's number one. Number two, uh, let's continue with the fusion. If he's amazing, you know, I'll take him as far as possible. If he's okay, you know, I'll stop at like purple plus three or something like that depending on how you know how good his ability sound and when we test them a little bit that's when we'll really know all right but let's just at first unlock all these abilities one by one all right so we got them to purple that's good what do we need here all right well i got a lot of those that's fine fusion uh sage ones no problem i guess okay this is where it must stop at purple plus two because I'm missing Scepter of the Abyss. So we're gonna wait there. All right, guys. So let's begin. Kadring Stone Hero. As always, oh, he's got an awakening too. My, my, my. That's pretty good. So let's see what the ultimate is all about. Supernova. Trigger a supernova that deals damage to all enemies. A black hole then forms, which pulls enemies towards it. Ha! That sounds pretty cool. Alright, so a supernova deals damage to everybody and then a black hole pulls everybody towards it. So it's going to kind of gang everybody up. So paired up with, uh, you know, some other heroes that do area damage sounds good right off the bat. Alright, gravity shift. Increase the gravity within a certain area on the battlefield. The increased gravity deals damage to enemies in the area and slows them down. Nice, very nice damage and slow mind control. Mazir takes control of the most distant enemy unit and pulls it towards him. After being released, the enemy unit will take some magic damage. Okay. Hmm, that sounds pretty weird. So, I, uh, so it takes control of the most distant enemy and pulls him closer and then deals some damage. Hmm, okay, okay. Mini black hole. Summon a small black hole that sucks in some projectiles shot from uh, enemies. Ineffective against projectiles fired by enemy ultimate. All right, so I'm um, guess so this is pretty much about um, Second and third fourth abilities basic attacks something like that, but not ultimate once the black hole has absorbed enough Projectiles or enough time has passed it will explode Dealing damage to nearby enemies the more projectiles were absorbed the more damage is dealt by the explosion Ah, so at level one right now it's 615 so it's very promising hmm it goes up by 15. Wow, it's actually really promising. All right, and then let's take a look at what happens to this guy once he is awakened. From the time Mazur enters the battlefield, he will continuously drain the intelligence of all enemy facing him. When their intelligence is drained to zero, they will enter a deranged state. In this state, their AoE tax or healing spell will affect both enemies and all allies, although the effects of the unintended target will be lessened depending on the ability level. What the freak am I just reading? The effects on the unintended target will also be reduced if Mazur has less than 7 star. 
So seven starting this guy sounds really sick. Ten percent if uh, if he has six stars, minus twenty percent if he has five stars, etc. All right, so thirty percent of four stars. So this awakening is incredible, but once you can, you know, this guy is released and you can get up to seven star. Wow. All right, so let's just go ahead, up, you know, grade these abilities a little bit here, guys. And then I will take him for a little action battle to test him out and see what our boy Mazur can do in battle and what these abilities actually look like. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's test him out. All right, so beginning, as always, with our combo wombo here. Yo, the entrance is sick. Wow, what a sick entrance. Uh-oh, getting hit by these arrows. All right, that's the mini black hole. This is ultimate, guys, here. Boom! And then pulls everybody to the center. Ha <laughs> ha ha! That's so sick. I love that. But this was too high of a stage for him. Poor little guy got destroyed. So let's go ahead and retreat and go to a lesser stage. Maybe like 10. I just want to see these abilities in action. Wow, they look incredible, guys. I love that ultimate. So the time shift that he comes out of the black hole is sick right there. Uh, starts off basic attack there. Then this is that... I don't even know what that ability is right there, but looks awesome. That's the mini black hole. Just doing a lot of damage. This guy is going to be a really, really heavy damage dealer, guys. It just looks like he's going to do a lot of damage. Oh, that's the second ability that he slows. The gravity. So that was the gravity one. He's got the mini black hole. Boom. And I'm not going to use his ultimate until I get to round two here, so... Wow, so his abilities are beautiful, man. I love these abilities. This guy looks phenomenal. Really, really sick. Oh, man. Another great Conjuring Stone hero. How about that? All right, so let's go ahead. This one will start right up from the start here with his ultimate, guys. Check this out. Boom! And the Black Hole, which is pulling everybody in. Now, if you can kind of pair this up with some heroes that are going to do a large amount of damage to a... You know, I mean, uh, uh, area. Yikes. There is a lot of combos that you can go with this guy, guys. Just off the top of my head, a lot of different combos. Let's do that again. I love this ability here. Wow, what a sick ability. Ooh, the animations are sick, too. It literally sh looks like there's a hole there. There's a hole there! And it's magic, so... Because I know this enemy is... Physic is immune to physical attacks. All right. All right. I've seen enough. That's it. I don't even need to see anymore. I see all the abilities and I know exactly what they do by now. That's so freaking sick. Let me really quickly, guys. Uh, Magnus is really good. This guy might be the best backliner released so far. Magnus is great. He's really, really good. But... To be honest, I think Mazur is the new king of the back row. The supernova is insane. I love the supernova. Gravity shift is the one that slows, deals damage. Mind control, I didn't really see this one too much. But I think it's because the low uh, level. It wasn't really affecting them. You know what I mean? Uh, this has to be maxed out. And then mini black hole, you saw that deals damage, right? So all those abilities, pretty easy to, you know, to see which one was what. And... This guy looks phenomenal. I love everything about him. Boy, I cannot wait till they release him so I can 7-star this guy, man. This looks incredible. Can't wait. All right, guys. So that'll be about it for the new guy, Mazur, the Cosmic Guardian. I hope you guys enjoy him. Let me know in the comments what you think if you got him. If you haven't gotten him yet, this is a quick spotlight when he's released. Boy, you got to go work on this guy, man. I'm loving Mazur a lot already. I can't wait to max him out and actually see everything that he does in action in the arena for more uh battles with mazir we'll do some more stuff uh on live but for now i'm ending this off here guys i will check you out next time on the next awakening all right so then have a good morning good afternoon good night peace out